Hey everyone, so I feel like it's been a long time since I filmed a video, but I just got back from Planner Con in San Francisco and I had such a great time and I wanted to share um, the swag that we got as well as some, some things that I picked up from the vendors. Um, I wanted, I really had planned to vlog a little bit more during the conference, um, but I always forget to do that, number one, and then number two, I was just having so much fun that, you know, I was just kind of like in the present moment, and then also, my whole thing about vlogging is I'm super shy to do it in public, so, yeah, I didn't get as much footage as I had hoped to, but at least I can show you the goodies I got. So, first of all, this is the canvas bag that we got, which was black this year, which I really appreciate, obviously, because I love my neutral colors. But this is a pretty good sized bag, too, and it was filled with stuff. So, I'm not going to go in any kind of order. I'm just going to start pulling stuff out. Um, so, first of all, we got this little... Um, I guess wristlet from Franklin Planner. Um, as soon as we walked into um, the ballroom, um, Franklin Planner was handing these out. So it's like a black leather, or I don't know if it's fake leather, little um, wristlet, which I thought was super cute. And, oh, let me show you this. So one of my planner besties that I actually met the first year I went to Planner Con, this is my third year going. Um, I met her there and we've hung out at Planner Con ever since and we keep in touch throughout the year as well. She actually made me some goodies this year. So she sews and she made um, these little, this like little keychain coin purse kind of thing. And it has TPS for the planner spot. And then she also made this like pencil pouch type of thing or you could use it for makeup or whatever with, with my logo on it in gold foil and then it has this little zipper and she used marble and gray because she knows that I'm all about the neutrals and then it has a little um, ring here as well so you can like hook tassels up to here or um, whatever you like and this is the name of I believe her and her sister shop I'll link them down below um, so you can check that out and see what other stuff they have but it was super cute i really love it a lot what else do we have here let's see um we got this little sticker pack from pip sticks oh and also so they gave out this she was super generous she gave out this and she gave us one of her new planners like a whole planner 17 month planner so it's really cute um like it even has stickers inside super colorful and even though colorful is not my thing i don't know i don't want to let go of this because i just think it's really really cute and fun like fun illustrations and have, this is how the monthly looks and the weekly so really cute really generous um yeah so check that out if you're interested i think she has a line of planners now she was announcing it she was one of the keynote speakers and she was announcing it that she started making planners so really cute as well as like a pack of stickers she has like a monthly um subscription for sticker kits or i think she calls it sticker club and then let's see i got a couple of things i got a, a lot of things from teresa collins so i kind of you know of course i've heard of teresa collins but i didn't really follow her on social media or anything like that and i started hearing a lot about her because she was a keynote speaker at planner con and did a lot of stuff with that whole team so i started hearing a lot about her and hearing her talk at the conference she was amazing, super inspiring, super fun, and she's so generous. She gave, so she gave out this planner. It looks like this on the inside. And then along with this, she gave us her um, Zyron, so sticker maker. So like you can make stickers out of any little like planner cards or 
die cuts that you have and it will make it into a sticker. So she gave both of these for free to everybody who attended the conference, which was super generous. And then not only that, but I attended her workshop session and she gave us a free photo album, another free planner. So I think, I think it has, yeah, the same kind of inside. So the same um, layout or designs on the inside, but just different covers. So this is a sparkly gold one. And then, oh, she gave us some die cuts as well, or little planner cards, if I can find them. Um, where are they? Maybe I'll find them in a minute, but um, yeah. So I'll find those in a second. I don't know where I put them, but I'll find them in this pile. But really generous, and she's such a great person. I chatted with her a little bit um, during the conference, and she's just super nice and down to earth. And her family, her husband and her son, were so cute and so supportive. Um, what else? Who did we get this from? We got this, so it's a full sticker book. I forget who we got this from. Sorry about that. Was it the Happy Planner? I don't remember, but we got like a full on sticker book from um, the Happy Planner company. It came with something else. I forget. There was so, we got so much stuff that it's hard to keep track of everything. Um, I also got this. I went to the Franklin Planner um, session and they were super generous. They gave everyone a package of like washi tape, stickers. There's little like magnetic bookmarks in here. And as soon as I walked in and saw this on the table, I knew I chose the right session because it had all this like neutral gold, black um, kind of designs. And then, let's see, what else? Um, I also went to, oh, from the Franklin Planner, they handed out these um, just to try out how their layout is. And I'm sure like many of you, Franklin Planner um, was one of my first, well, was my very first planner I ever used. And so I'm very familiar with this layout, but they had these little samples of like 21 day planner. So you can try it out, and then if you like it, you can purchase their inserts. Really liked that a lot. And I really liked um, the Franklin Planner workshop. They did a great job, a great, very informative, very functional, useful information. Um, Avery was there, and I got, we got this in our swag bag which are their tabs, and I, I don't know, I think this is new, I've never seen it before, but they have metallic colors, like gold, silver, and rose gold, and bronze, I guess, or copper or something, and then the pastels. And then I went to their table, and I also won um, another pack, which I was super excited about. I actually had, what I'm gonna show you guys today is just the stuff I'm deciding to keep, but I actually had a bunch more. Some stuff I gave to my daughters. So like Avery, I also won a pack of emoji label stickers. And then um, I also gave a bunch of stuff to my planner besties that I hang out with at PlannerCon just because I loved all this stuff, but I am I know for sure I'm not gonna use it. So they actually gathered it all and gave it to a friend that couldn't make it to the conference. So that was really cool to be able to share that. So what I'm showing you is not everything I got. I got a ton of stuff, like three bags full of stuff. But what I'm showing you is the stuff I decided to keep. So that's from Avery. I really like these a lot. I'm already using it in my planner. I'll show you guys soon. Um, we got a bunch of stuff from Erin Condren. And I can't... Everything's kind of like I threw it into a bag. So it's all mixed up. But we got this sticker book. Um... Oh, we got some markers, which I gave to my daughter because she she's the artist. Um, and I can't remember what else we got. We got a like a, a pack of stuff from Erin Condren. It all came in this cute bag, which I kept to, just to use as a gift bag. Um, but this was one of them, so it came with these 
stickers, all these stickers. It's a full book of stickers. Over 500. Over 500. So yeah, that's that was super generous. And then, oh, here's the Teresa Collins. So here's the um, die cuts that we got in her session, which she already gave us a bunch of stuff. So that was so generous of her. And they are the perfect size to use in her Xyron. So she demonstrated it during the session. So I can make all of these into stickers to put into my planner. Really cute. My daughter's trying to steal the Xyron from me. I'll probably give it to her, but I want to play with it first. Um, what else? I have this little bag full of stuff and then a few other things. So I'm showing you, I think, all the stuff that I got for free. And then at the end, I'll show you stuff that I bought. Um, there were some swaps that I decided to keep, like this cute little bow. It's like a crocheted bow clip. I got this on the D stash table, so they had two D stash tables at the conference, and people just put things there that they didn't want to use anymore, and um, other people picked it up. So I picked this up just because it was really cute and gray, and it I thought about using it as a coaster because I'm looking for a fabric coaster. So this was made by Yarn Over Mary, and this one was made by Crafty Like a Boss. So yeah, really cute. Um, let's see what else. Got this little crown clip. Um, what are they called? Let me open this. Sometimes if I'm sharing it here, I'd like to, just in case you guys want to get it, I want to share it, what shops it came from. So if you want to get it. So this was from... Ever Creations EV3R, but I think it's Ever Creations. Really cute. I'm really into crowns. I don't know if I ever shared that with you guys, but super cute. And then we got oh, Franklin Planner was giving out these really cute planner pins. Love that. And I got oh, some washi samples. I think. This is Janice Plans It Out, and I think I also threw extra washi samples in here. So I don't know if these are all from her, sh from her, this person, but I got some Simply Gilded washi samples, and I don't know what shop this is from. I, it looks like it could be from Paca Post, or I don't know, but I love me some foiled bows, so I kept that. And then got some other free washi. So these came, this came with other washi, but I only kept the ones that I thought I would really use. So this is like a cute purple one with rose gold foiled bows. And then this is from Inspired Life Studios. And then this one was really cute. I don't know if I'll really use it, but I really love foiled bows, so I kept it for now. But this is from U Uniquely Zoe. And, oh, I got these really cute binder pen clip things. And I don't know who gave it to me. They just had it, like, in a little case, and you could choose what you wanted. Those were really cute. Um, oh, I ran into Simply Gilded. Um, Irene from Simply Gilded, and she had, like, a box of stickers and pins, and you could choose what you wanted. And I got this really cute pink bow pin. I was excited about getting that. Oh, another thing Teresa Collins gave. So everything's mixed in. Sorry, it's not all together. But she gave us this really pretty pen. White with gold. Totally my aesthetic. She was just really generous. She gave out so much stuff. And she had tons of giveaways during her... Um, or like raffle drawings during her workshop. Um, let's see. I also got this really cute crown washi as a swap from... From not from Little Miss Papery, from somebody, but it this washi is from Little Miss Papery, and again with the crowns because I'm really into crowns. And then, oh, I just grabbed some more <laughs> of these metallic tabs from Avery because they were giving away for free on their table, they had samples, so I grabbed some of those too. And my friends grabbed some as well, and they gave me all the metallic ones that they got because I love them a lot. We got this PlannerCon um, pin, 
It came with a lollipop, which my daughter, my daughter stole from me, but I kept the pin. Really cute. I collect pins, and I just keep them in my jewelry box, but I wanted to put them on, like, um, like a jean jacket, maybe, I was thinking. Or I like to put it on my canvas tote bag sometimes. This was a swap from Planner Shops on, or Planner Shop com or planner shops on Instagram really cute totally my aesthetic this is a washi card super cute and then I also met um, Jasenia which was on my bucket list of people to me I wanted to meet so I wanted to meet um, Irene which I've met her before Irene from simply gilded I wanted to meet um, Marg from once more with love and I saw her but she looked kind of busy so I didn't approach her but I did see her I wanted to meet Cynthia from Wonton in a Million which I did oh and I got something from her oh yeah I met Cynthia I wanted to meet Jasenia from the Planner Sophisticate and I wanted to meet um Jessica Hart shop Jessica Hart's and I looked for her. I couldn't find her. Um, I know she was only there for a short time, not the whole weekend. I didn't find her. I wanted to meet Andrea from Scribble Prints Co. I didn't, I never saw her. I wanted to meet, um, I forgot her name now, from Kittenish, Kittenish Plans. She has a clip art shop. I did see her, but um, she was like talking with people, so I didn't approach her. And I also saw her with Lauren, I think her name is, from Rose Colored Days. And they were all talking like in a group of people, so I didn't approach them. Sometimes I get shy. <laughs> and so I wanted to meet them. And But the ones I did meet was Irene from Simply Gilded, um, Cynthia from Wonton in a Million, so she, this was her swap. It has a sticky notes and some San Francisco themed stickers and this little card about how her stuff is available in Michael's now, which I've seen and I told her congratulations. Um, I met Jacinia from the Planner Sophisticate. She has a super cute swap. So I really wanted to meet her too because I love her stuff and I always admire, I watch her YouTube videos and she has really beautiful style so she gave like this foiled die cut some planner cards and some are foiled like this so cute and like a bookmark I guess foiled like a lot of this stuff is foiled but um what was really cute well there's this other journaling card so cute but what was really cute and surprising is she gave like a little sample of her inserts so she does printable inserts on her Etsy shop and she gave a sample which was so cool and I definitely want to try these out because I think they're so pretty sorry if I was out of frame but yeah this just says buy me cute pants and tell me I'm pretty <laughs> so yeah I was really excited to meet her I never really talked to these people much I just say hi I'm a fan of your stuff and then I kind of sneak away because I'm I'm pretty shy in person. That's why you never really like see my face on these videos. Um, so, but at least I got to meet her and get her cute swap. Um, we got this freebie in our swag bag from Planning World. I was super excited when I found out she was going to be a vendor at PlannerCon. I did buy some stuff, which I'll show you in a minute. But she did also give this freebie out in our swag bag. Samantha May Sticks. I was super excited to see her. Um, as a vendor at Planner Con, I bought some stuff from her shop as well, but this was a freebie she gave um, in the swag bag. And she actually is super generous. She gave tons of stuff to the, uh, you know, main general raffle. I was really hoping to win something, but it's okay. I bought stuff from her shop. Super generous and really cute stuff. Um, this came with something. Oh, I met Peach Palm. So I kind of heard that she was going um, and then I had it in my mind that I wanted to meet her and then I totally forgot and I just randomly went up, I, I was randomly going up to people to give them my swap 
which I should have brought a copy up here to show you guys. But anyways, I randomly approached her not knowing who she was, gave her my swap, and then she gave me this. And I'm like, oh my gosh, you're the peach palm. I love your stuff. So this was super cute swap from her. And then Ink by Jang was there, one of my favorite vendors at PlannerCon. She was giving, wait, is this the one she gave out? I think, yeah, something like one of these, there's two sheets. Let me get the other one. One of them she gave out as a swap and one was free. I think this was free in our swag bag and then this she gave as a swap. So really cute, totally up my alley. Minimalist shop and I love it. And then I got this from Fun Chick Designs. And it really caught my attention because of Target and all these cute stickers. But really, I was like, oh my gosh, that's the Friends store frame, which my son actually bought. Someone made a frame like this on Etsy, I think. And he bought it and he has it in his very first apartment ever hanging on his door right now. That's super cute. This was the Simply Gilded Planner Con exclusive washi that was given to us. So this time, this year, we got two, which is really cool. I think in past years, we only got one. And then we got this exclusive PlannerCon Pin Gems pin. And it's super cute with the pink. I was so happy about that. And it has like pink and blue and like peach, I think, little jewels inside. So it's really cute, super generous. I went up to them after and hugged them and said thank you so much for giving us all that. Um, so I have this washi. So this is part of the Simply Gilded and Teresa Collins collab. I didn't even know they were collabing. And that it was a box of five washi. And I really didn't care about getting the, I mean, the other washi was beautiful, but I just knew I wouldn't use it. But I really wanted this one which is like, let me see if I could open it. It's like a very subtle marble um, background with gold foiled bows. And I really wanted this one a lot. And so what I did is I just bought the whole box and I gave the rest to my planner besties that I met at PlannerCon the first year and we hang out every year. So I, And there's four of them and there were five washi. So I kept this one and I gave them each the other ones so this is actually part of a set which is I think going on sale on the Simply Gilded website this Friday um, March 8th so I picked this one up and then I also got some stickers like I mentioned before I visited the planning world booth and I have bought from her before on her shop online and so I was excited to see her stuff more of her stuff um, in person at PlannerCon so I got these um, functional work stickers as a laptop, like paperwork, printing, planner, and desks, two type of desks. Really cute. So this is like white. It might, I think it has like a very light gray water color background. And then this one is a rose gold, I think, um, shop themed set. So it has shopping bags, shopping carts, and shopping list. Really pretty. And then this one is a male themed set. And so it's pink with the envelopes, stamp, mailbox, like package, and the post office like mailbox. And that's, is that, oh yeah, I guess that's all I got from her. I went for more of the, of course, fu functional and more neutral type stickers. And then I bought some stickers from Samantha May. Oh, I kind of put some, like, put some stickers all together here. So it's kind of mixed up, but forgot to show you um, these stickers, these swaps. So this one, this is one of my planner besties, Plan with Char on Instagram. She doodled these super cute little stickers. And then her sister um, doodled this planner. And she had different colors, I think, as she saved a black one for me, of course. And that's her Instagram. And then I met... Um, 
Tina from Brooklyn Grace Co. And it turns out that she actually, I think, follows my shop, follows me on Instagram or something. And so that was cool meeting someone that knew about the planner spot. And she had these really pretty um, foiled samplers to swap. And I checked out her shop. She has really cute stuff, so I'm about to place an order soon. And then I got, oh, I got such cute fall samplers. So this one is from bod bodaciousprints.com. And look at this cute sampler she made. It's silver foil on pink paper. It's really cute. And then this one is from her as well and they're like scalloped foil headers so they're scallops really cute gold foil on pink paper and then this oh this one's from her as well so this is date covers silver um foil or is it hollow it might be hollow foil i'm not good at i'm new to the foil world i don't really buy much foiled stuff or i mean i do but very little and um so I think this one's hollow, really cute. And then I bought some stuff from Samantha May Sticks and she gave um, a freebie with it, like this gold foiled bow. And then I bought some bow banners. These are so cute. And then I bought this um, planner bow planners, some bow pencils for writing blog posts, some bow cameras for Instagram posts. Most of these I try to look for rose gold and they're on white paper. Some bow phones for um, videos because I do film on my iPhone. Some bow carts for shop stuff. Some bow laptops for designing. And then, oh, some bow um, coffee cups for like chatting with um, people on, on social media. And then these are small little bows on clear paper and they're individual. I don't want to mess it up. You can see they're kiss cut. I don't want to take it off because then I will have a hard time putting it back on, but I don't know if you can see their kiss cut around. So just little single bows that um, I really like because they're so minimalistic. And then same things with these hearts. It's on clear paper, individual bows, kiss cut. And then these, I got two sheets of this because I really love this shade of pink, very pale, um, individual bows as well, but this is on pink paper or pink background. So I really, really like her shop a lot. I really like her stuff. And like I said, she was super generous. She gave so much to the raffles. Everyone kept saying, oh my gosh, another Samantha May sticks package for the raffle. And um, so yeah, highly recommend her shop. Good quality stuff. And then I bought a pen. So some of my friends there at the conference were telling me, cause they know I only use erasable pens. They were telling me that Filofax has an erasable pen now for they that they made to go along with their clip books, but you can buy it separately, which I did, and they, that they had a rose gold. So I ran right over and bought it. So it erases really good. So it's a ballpoint pen. I don't remember what um, point it is. I think it might be a point five, maybe. Um, and it writes well for a ballpoint pen and it erases very well and the pen is gorgeous. So this is the eraser part, but that's also where the pen point comes out. Um, it's a twisty one. I really love it a lot. It fits the Louis Vuitton MM Agenda pen loop, but I don't like ballpoint pens. So I just don't like the way they write. So my French, my friction gel pen writes much more smoother and thicker, I feel like. And so I'm trying to figure out, I still wanna use this. I'm trying to figure out if I could find a um, 
refill, erasable refill that's gel that I can just put in here. But for now, um, I'm using it for now, but I really want to find a gel refill for this, but it's beautiful. It costs like, I don't know, under $20. <clears throat> and then I also bought something that I definitely do not need, but I've been eyeballing for so long. I got myself a Hobonichi, the, I don't even know what it's called, the small one, basically. This is like a, kind of like a pocket size. I don't know if it's exactly the pocket size, but it's around that size. It's much smaller than personal size. And so I bought this um, because my friends are enablers. <laughs> And I really love it a lot, actually. And so I think I'm going to use it for daily journaling just because it's less pressure because it's so small. And so maybe, and also because it's dated, it'll kind of like, you know, kind of push me to write something every day. And I have been journaling. I was doing it pretty consistently in the beginning of the year and then I kind of fell off. But maybe this will uh, motivate me to start up again. And so, yeah, I'm planning to use it as a journal for now. So we'll see. But it's so cute. I love it so much. And then um, I think the last thing I bought were these humongous sticker albums from, I think it's Pegatina Plans. You see there? Um, I really wanted the smaller album that's, that kind of fits, um, you know, a standard kit size sticker page. And this will fit, but they're smaller ones. There's a next size down from this, but they didn't have it in this marble color. And I really wanted the marble, just the plain marble. So I bought two of them. They're kind of bigger. <clears throat> Let me see. So this is like a standard quarter sheet size. So you can tell how big this... Um, sticker book is so it's gonna be like if you put two of these together which is the size of like a kit page this is how it would look like a regular kit size sheet half sheet of stickers in there so it'll fit it's kind of big but I just couldn't pass it up they were so cute and they had special conference pricing so basically once I take it out of the cello it'll look like this and I'm gonna plan to put my kits in here and as well as my subs so I can keep like um, past subs on file. I really like them a lot. So I'm gonna, her shop is closed right now, but I think it's opening again on Friday. I'm gonna check out what else she has. But these are super cute. And then with, as a freebie, she was giving out, she had like a bunch of little freebies that you can buy when you order or when you purchase from her booth. And so I got this little gold um foiled spot overlay so it's on clear paper so you can overlay it on your spreads and that's about it i think that's all i got um i mean that's not all i got that's all i kept i got much much more trust me but yeah so planner con overall was super fun let me put something here so you're not just staring at a white <laughs> A white background. Um, Planner Con was super fun. The best part um, was the friends I met and we just had so much fun hanging out all weekend, laughing so much. Um, the speakers, 99.9% .9 of the speakers were fantastic and great and I connected with one of them and hopefully um, I'm gonna she offered to just you know answer questions I have and give me business advice and stuff like that so that was super exciting um and the shopping of course was so fun um I just wanted to share with you guys all the stuff that we got at planner con I had such a good time it was super fun and now that I showed you everything I can finally go play with it so see ya